food, a whole food, or otherwise when we eat a food, that food, that supplement goes down our gullet into our stomach where it's mechanically broken down and dissolved in our digestive juices. And from there, our supplement, whole food or otherwise, moves into the intestine where it's further broken down and it's further processed. At this point, at this point of uh, contact between the food or the supplement or the whole food supplement and the intestine, this is where absorption takes place, absorption into the body. But this is different from absorption into the cells of the body. This is just absorption into the body. You know, when you put something in your mouth and it goes in your digestive system, that's not really in your body technically. It's in your digestive tract, which is technically isolated from the rest of your body, except for a few little places where it gets into the body. So you eat your food, take your supplement, it goes into the intestine. At this point, at this point, this is where the various types of nutrients, the various forms of nutrients, and the various proportions of nutrients are going to play a role. This is where foods have their advantage over supplements, and this is where whole food supplements have their advantage over regular supplements. In the case of minerals, because of their natural positive charge, the body has to attach certain molecules to change the electrical charge of minerals in order to get them into the intestinal cells. That's called chelation. You probably heard the term chelation and the body naturally will chelate minerals. So you'll eat a whole food or a whole food supplement or whatever you're eating. You put it in your mouth. It goes into your intestine. The mineral is separated out from the food, from your hamburger, from your supplement. Now that mineral has a positive charge. That mineral with a positive charge is not going to make it into the intestine. The body has to protect it. The body has to somehow cover that positive charge up. And it will do it in a process called chelation. The most important natural chelating agent is something called picolinate. You guys have all heard me talk about zinc picolinate. You've probably seen chromium picolinate. Picolinate is a substance that's made in the body. And the body sticks picolinate onto a mineral. And then that mineral will get absorbed as a picolinate, absorbed into the intestine. Food-based minerals, plant-based minerals, colloidal minerals, these also have their positive charges protected. And this is why, this is where food-based minerals and colloidal minerals have their advantage. This is why the Beyond Tangy Tangerine minerals have their advantage over the cheapo kind of minerals that you get in drugstores. This is why, the doctor, this is what's Dr. Wallet's great insight, or one of his great insights, was the idea that a colloidal mineral, a plant-based mineral, is better absorbed than an inorganic mineral. The colloidal form, the protected form, makes it not only more readily absorbable, but also makes it non-toxic. That's why you can uh, eat all the colloidal iodine you want, and all it will be is a nutritional supplement or a nutritional, uh, all it will provide is nutritional support, but if you did regular iodine with a positive charge on it, it would kill you. Colloidal minerals are protected. Colloidal minerals are more readily taken in. Same with plant-based minerals. Same with whole food supplement minerals. This is where whole foods really have an advantage. Whole foods have their advantage at the level of absorption into the intestine. The problem is, is the doses. You're not getting the kind of doses that you need, and you're paying a heck of a lot of money for a whole food, for a tiny little bit of a whole food. In terms of vitamins... Vitamins are activated by digestive juices, and then they're carried into the intestinal cells by various molecules that are called transport molecules or carrier molecules that sort of attach themselves to the vitamin and chaperone them into the intestinal cell. And here again, food vitamins and food-based vitamins are probably going to be taken in more effectively because of proportions and because of cofactors and because of the amounts of the vitamins. Higher doses of vitamins may affect absorption. You may get, if you take a higher dose of vitamin than you need, you may not get the absorption that you, you may not be absorbing all of that vitamin. This is why it's always a good idea to divide your doses. This is why, in my opinion, it's better to sip on your Beyond Tangy Tangerine than to take it in all at once in one big dose. And again, this is where food-based supplements, while being more expensive, may be advantageous in the sense that you're not going to be wasting, you won't be wasting nutrients, but again, you won't be getting as much either. How the body uh, proper, how the body specifically, how the cells inside the body, the final destination of our nutrient, 
uses essential molecules after they've entered into the bloodstream through the intestine, that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter when a bone cell gets the vitamin C or a heart cell gets the vitamin C or a brain cell gets the vitamin C. It doesn't know. The heart cell, the brain cell, the bone cell, the liver cell, it doesn't know that that vitamin C came from an orange. It doesn't know that that vitamin C came from a new chapter whole food supplement. It doesn't know that the vitamin C came from a, a regular vitamin C pill. It just knows that it's vitamin C at the point where the nutrient is going to be used for biochemistry. I'm not talking about absorption in through the intestine. I'm talking about at the point where that nutrient is being used for biochemistry, for making collagen, for upregulating some kind of chemical process, for detoxification or for whatever. It only matters that that nutrient is present and present in sufficient quantities for the chemistry to proceed at the point where the nutrient is used, not where it's absorbed into the, into, uh, the blood through the intestine, at the point where it is used by the blood cell, by the uh, bone cell, by the liver cell, by the brain cell, at the point where the brain cell or the whatever cell meets the vitamin C, all that matters to that cell is, is that stuff vitamin C? Is that stuff magnesium? Is that stuff chromium? Is that stuff calcium? It doesn't matter where it came from. It doesn't matter if it came from an orange or a pepper or a whole food supplement or beyond tangy tangerine or anything else. And by the way, the synonym for vitamin C is ascorbic acid. So anybody out there saying, well, you don't want ascorbic, and I hear this, this is craziness, you don't want ascorbic acid, ascorbic acid can't be used, I hear all kinds of things about ascorbic acid as if it was a different molecule, it's not, it's a synonym for vitamin C. Vitamins have chemical names, all vitamins have chemical names, the chemical name for vitamin B1 is thiamine, the chemical name for vitamin B2 is riboflavin, the chemical name for vitamin B3 is niacin, and the chemical name for vitamin C is ascorbic acid. It's not a different form of vitamin C, it's not an artificial form of vitamin C, it's not a toxic or in any way problematic form of vitamin C. It's a synonym for vitamin C. To the gal who wrote me a letter saying how disappointed she was that the Beyond Tangy Tangerine is made with ascorbic acid and vitamin C, please understand that ascorbic acid is vitamin C. And by the time our vitamin C has passed through the intestinal cells and entered into the body via the blood, there's no more orange or chili pepper or mango, or cantaloupe, or lemon left in it. It's just vitamin C, and at that point, it doesn't matter. Once it has entered into the blood system from the digestive tract, where it comes from, it doesn't matter where that source was. If that vitamin C came from a whole food supplement, that may be an advantage as far as absorption into the intestine goes, or through the intestine, but it's irrelevant to the final body cell, the liver cell, the bone cell, the immune cell, whatever cell that is absorbing it. All right, I got a few more things I want to say, and then we will get to your phone calls at 855 660 4261. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We'll be back right after this. Don't go away. Did you know that organic sulfur can cleanse and defend your body against the poisons we're exposed to each day? Organic sulfur crystals from sulfurdefense.com help by forcing oxygen and nutrition into your cells while eliminating heavy metals, contaminants, and damaging radiation. Defend yourself and family from toxic assault with one of the most critical and essential minerals available today. Order online at sulfurdefense.com. That's sulfurdefense.com. Or call 800-593-6273. Please pay attention, folks. AmericanSurvivalWholesale.com is a Christian, veteran-owned wholesale preparedness company. Our mission is to get the Word of God out to all those in need of a Bible and who cannot afford one. We also provide great-tasting freeze-dried food from only 50 cents per serving, GMO-free food, over 1,000 preparedness items. Plus, for a limited time, type in the word Genesis at checkout and receive 10% off your total purchase. That's AmericanSurvivalWholesale.com. This alert just came in. This special announcement is for business owners and leaders of organizations who've been waiting for the right time to build. General Steel has made it impossible to wait any longer with rock-bottom prices that could save you thousands. That's right. General Steel, America's leader in pre-engineered structures, is offering buildings at prices you will never see again. Don't miss these prices. A 50 by 100 for under $30,000. You heard right. That's 5,000 square feet under $30,000. 
manufacturers. If you need a larger building, try a 100 by 100 commercial building for 129000 You can't afford to rent with these prices. Imagine a 70 by 100 foot church building for under $69,000. With the economy improving and interest rates still at historic lows, you can't afford to wait. So call 866-91-STEEL. Lock in your price now. Take delivery in spring. 866-91-STEEL. That's 866-917-8335. We travel so much, and having a fake TV, well, it gives added peace of mind. Burglars look for houses that appear to be easy targets. But fake TV can fool even professional burglars into thinking someone is home watching television. As a recent widow living alone, it gives me great peace of mind to set my fake TV near a window and know that passing motorists and pedestrians will think someone is home watching TV when I'm actually away from home. Fake TV easily plugs into any outlet, just like a light on a timer. And they're so easy to use, you just plug them in and they're ready to go. Plus, they're so affordable that we have one upstairs and downstairs. Fake TV is only $29.95 with free shipping. Order your fake TV by calling 877-5-FAKE-TV or go to faketv.com. That's 877-532-5388 or faketv.com. Fake TV, the burglar deterrent. Don't complain about your cable bill going up and up and up. Do something about it. Grab a pencil and jot down this special number. 1-855-905-MY-TV. The more cable TV rates go up, the better digital satellite TV looks. Say goodbye to the cable guy and get more of your favorite channels in 100% digital quality for less money. Call 1-855-905-MY-TV. Sign up for packages starting as low as $19.99 and there's no equipment to buy. You get free HD TV upgrade, a free DVR upgrade, and free professional and Installation. You control what you watch when you watch it. Record your favorite shows. Pause and rewind live TV. Even skip the commercials. Watch local channels, too. At just $19.99, what are you waiting for? Pull out your major credit or debit card. Call 1-855-905-MY-TV. 1-855-905-MY-TV. Say goodbye to the cable guy. Cut costs and get more. 1-855-905-MY-TV. 1-855-905-MY-TV. Great news, pure water lovers. BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com has a special discount offer for all GCN listeners. You can't do better than a Big Berkey for economy. For only 1.7 cents a gallon, a single set of filters can last for 5 to 10 years. There's none better than a Big Berkey for emergency preparedness as a backup water source. And you just can't beat a Big Berkey to remove dangerous chlorine, all types of fluoride, pathogenic bacteria, cysts, parasites, and unhealthy bodies. Byproducts from municipal water. Berkey water filter systems are even powerful enough to purify stagnant pond water. For the gold standard in water filters, get a Big Berkey at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com. And all GCN listeners get 5% off all ceramic filter systems. For details, call 1-877-99-BERKEY. That's 877-99-BERKEY. Big Berkey water filters for the love of clean water. Independently leading the way for the nation. Compelling talk for every political persuasion. We are G. I farm Ben. I just got a couple more things I want to say about this notion of whole foods, uh, whole food vitamins, and then we'll just put this subject to rest. Unless you guys have anything you want to add to the conversation, eight five five six six zero forty two sixty one is our number. So number one, you spend your thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, up to seventy bucks I've seen for your whole food supplement, and that's great, but you're getting whole food. Why not just eat whole food? What's the point of using a whole food supplement when all it is is whole food stuck in a capsule, ground up and perhaps concentrated a little bit? But really, it's just tiny, tiny little smatterings, as you can tell by looking at the supplement facts on most of these products, which are really insignificant when it comes to doses. That's the first thing. You're getting basically just tiny little amounts of nutrients, and you're basically getting food. The second point is that absorption into the intestine 
not into the cells, the bone cells, the liver cells, the, the uh, various cells of the body, brain cell, whatever. Absorption through the digestive tract, through the intestine, into the blood. You do need to have cofactors and various uh, substances associated with your vitamins and minerals to maximize, maximize absorption. And this is where a whole food supplement will provide you with some advantage. Now, you're not going to get a lot of nutritional value, but 